Hi children, welcome to A plus learning. Here we are with our next chapter, Magnetic Effect of Electric Current. Today in this video, I'll be explaining about Orsted's magnetic needle experiment and all about right hand thumb rule. Children, this is the picture of Hans Christian Orsted. His lifespan was from 1777 to 1851. He was a famous scientist who conducted many experiments in the field of magnetic effect of electric current. His experiments marked the beginning of the technology behind the devices used today, like the radio, TV, and fiber optics. You know, children, in the year 1820, he accidentally noticed that a magnetic needle kept near a current carrying conductor experienced deflection. Thus, the unbreakable relation between electricity and magnetism was realized for the first time. As a mark of respect to him, the CGS unit of intensity of magnetic field has been named as or state. Now, Let's see a similar experiment that led Austin to this particular conclusion. Here we have an arrangement in which a circuit is arranged above the pivoted magnetic needle in such a way that the conductor is parallel and very close to the magnetic needle. Now, let's see the direction of the current when the circuit is switched off. The direction of the current is from north to south. When the current is from north to south, the deflection of the magnetic needle is from north to east. That means this is in a clockwise direction. Now, let's see the similar arrangement, but here we have the direction of the current from south to north. When the current flows from south to north, observe the direction of deflection of the magnetic needle. It is getting deflected from north to west. That means this is getting deflected in the anti-clockwise direction. So the direction of the magnetic needle is from north to east when the current flows from north to south and the direction of the magnetic needle in which it get deflected is from north to west when the current passes from south to north. You know children, a magnetic field is developed around a current carrying conductor. The magnetic field is deflected as a result of the mutual action of this magnetic field and that of the magnetic needle. From this what do we understand? It is understood that a magnetic field is developed around a current carrying conductor. Now let's consolidate our things that is conductor above the magnetic needle. Here we have it is in the south to north direction. You observe in the diagram it is from south to north and we have already learned that once it is from south to north we have the deflection from north to west. So this is in the anti-clockwise direction. Okay, now we have the second one that is from north to south, from north to south. And when it is from north to south, we have the magnetic needle deflection from north to east. That is from north to east, that is in the clockwise direction. Now let's see what says right hand thumb rule. Here we have Imagine you are holding a current carrying conductor. Dear kids, you just have to imagine holding a conductor in your right hand. Never touch a conductor with an electric flow in it or else you will get a shock. Imagine you are holding a current carrying conductor with a right hand in such a way that the thumb points in the direction of the current. Here in the figure it shows that the thumb points in the direction of the current. The direction in which the other fingers encircle the conductor gives the direction of the magnetic field. That is, the direction in which the 
other fingers and circle here we have the direction of the magnetic field over here next we have the right hand screw rule the right hand screw rule can be used when a direction must be determined based upon a rotational direction or vice versa and the rule states that if a right hand screw is rotated in such a way that its tip advances along the direction of the current in the conductor then the direction of rotation of the screw gives the direction of the magnetic field around the conductor children just imagine you are drilling a screw towards your right the direction of the screw in which you rotate gives the direction of the magnetic field of the conductor and its tip advances towards the direction of the current isn't it easy children dear kids in the next video we will be learning the magnetic field around a straight conductor and also through a circular conductor so till then bye and stay safe please subscribe my channel for more videos and press the bell icon to receive notifications